So here's a top tip for YouTube channel trailers. Just don't bother making one. Say what? VidIQ. VidIQ. VidIQ.com. All right, I don't know if this is just me, but something feels broken with changing channel trailers. First of all, on your YouTube page, click on Customize Channel. That takes you to the old layout, and then you have to click on For New Visitors. Then it shows you a very pixelated thumbnail of your current trailer. And in the right-hand side, although we can't see it in a moment, you should see an Edit button if you mouse over it, which allows you to change your trailer. Hang on, hang on. You're telling us not to make a channel trailer? Yeah, and you want to know whose fault that is? Yours. Whoa, that was a little weird, but anyway. Hello, folks. My name is Rob. Welcome to vidIQ. Thank you for watching this video today and to our awesome community who posts on all of our videos every single day. If you are new to these glorious YouTube surroundings, we are indeed the YouTube tool and channel that aims to help you get more views in less time by educating you on your YouTube journey. Our Chrome extension, which allows you to research YouTube, analyze videos, audit your own channel, and take actionable steps, is free free to download, a link is in the description. But today we're going completely back to basics, the YouTube channel trailer. A very short piece of content that's designed to show off exactly what your channel is about and who should be watching. But do you really need one? You see, the thing is, I posted a poll in our community tab and that's something that you should definitely use on your channel and the results were absolutely astonishing. Of the 750 people who responded to this poll, almost half of you said that a channel trailer has no influence on whether or not you subscribe to the channel, a quarter of you said you never even see the channel trailer, and less than a third are influenced at all by a channel trailer. So why is this? Well, fortunately, some of those voters actually posted comments as to why, so let's take a look at some, because we know channels love shoutouts in videos. Jawald says whenever they go to someone's channel to see if they're worth subscribing to, they always actually pause the trailer as soon as it's starts playing. Instead, they look at videos and whether they upload regularly because they don't want to sub to a channel that hasn't uploaded in months. Pegasus Angels Gameplay says that they get stuck in a watch trap on channels that they enjoy, so it's more a case of watching three or four videos that convinces them to subscribe to the channel. And of course, they're looking for recent uploads as well. Both Two Wheel Aussie and Oliver the Joy Boy, fantastic username there, sir, were a little concerned about how a channel trailer may not accurately reflect the normal or real content. As for Nightmare Gadgets, well, they say that they very rarely see the channel trailer because they find most of their content through search and subscribe directly from the video that they're watching. Now, to make sure we are fair and balanced on this, Dicey Girl D3E did say that a channel trailer would influence whether they subscribe to a channel because it shows them exactly what they're subbing to, which is the purpose of a channel trailer after all. But what the hey, I love voting polls and reading your comments, so let's do this all over again. Do channel trailers influence whether or not you subscribe to a channel? Vote here and post in the comments below. So if you don't create a specific channel trailer, is there something that you should put there instead? Well there is and this is what you should be looking for. Now, as if by some miracle of coincidence, we have just a tool that will help you with this job. It's called Channel Audit, and when you click on it, it gives you a report card on your channel. Now, in the Content to Double Down On section, it shows you all of your best performing videos in different categories, and what we want to look at here is subscribers gained. This shows you the best videos on your channel for converting viewers into subscribers. In other words, building trust with your audience. It's ranked by conversion rate, so the top video here converts 28 people into subscribers per 1,000 views. However, if we want to find out the video with the most total subscribers gained, we can click on the view more button. I think any of these videos accurately represent the true value of what you can get from subscribing to vidIQ, and in this case we've chosen the how to get 4,000 hours of watch time one, since it's an evergreen piece of content throughout the whole of 2018, so we don't have to change it in the near future. How about that then folks, I've just managed to save you a ton of time by not bothering making a channel trailer, just use a video from your existing content that converts a high number of subscribers. You are welcome. However, if you do want to make a traditional channel trailer for your YouTube channel, consider these points. In terms of length, try and think of your trailer as a television commercial, 30 seconds or less. Think about the tone and pace of a trailer. It probably wants to be quite fast with a lot of different scenes, jumping maybe every two or three seconds. You could start by introducing yourself to camera in about five to 10 seconds, and then jump to loads of B-roll while you do some voiceover narration. And finally, try and tell a story in that trailer. 
Why are you doing this? Why are you passionate about the topic you're going to cover? And why is it valuable to your audience? I forgot to turn those on during the last scene, didn't I? Continuity. Hate it. Anyway, this was an experimental video to involve you, our awesome community, more in our videos. So if you feel part of a family, let us know with a hashtag vidiq for life. If you want us to do more vidIQ community videos just like this, do let us know. And if you want to watch that video on how to get 4,000 hours of watch time, we've got it over here. We've got an amazing video on keyword research down there. That's a wrap for channel trailers. We'll see you in those videos. Enjoy the rest of your video making day.